How's it going, everybody, and welcome to this week's Sub Saturdays. So to recap this week, on Monday we did Let's Play Oblivion Part 49, where we did some side quests in the Shivering Isles. Wednesday saw Let's Play Oblivion Part 50, the big one. I had my friend Ryan do a duo commentary, and we had face cam, we did some of our favorite Daedric quests. And on Friday we had Let's Play Oblivion Part 51, where we finished off most of the Shivering Isles side quests. As some of you have probably realized, I've replaced the Banjo-Tooie Let's Play currently with all of the Elder Scrolls Online footage I was able to record over the beta weekend. Now I've got some more videos left over in the vault, but uh, yeah, once that's over with, I'll sort of go back to the Banjo-Tooie Let's Play until the Elder Scrolls Online comes out, and then we'll sort of change the schedule to fit it. So that being said, I upload an episode of On Place the Elder Scrolls Online on Tuesday and Thursday. And finally, of course, tomorrow will be another Skyrim's Hidden Treasure. Now, there's not a lot to talk about this week, but I did want to talk about one thing. And also, if you haven't followed me on Twitter, go ahead and do that because I am tweeting and trying to build up my Twitter follow base, whatever you want to call it. Also, I am in a bunch of digital media classes for college, and I redesigned my channel art. I was going to pay someone, like, you know, to professionally do it, but I was like, eh, I'm in a digital media class right now. Why don't I just try my hand at Photoshop? So I hope you guys like the new channel art. So the only thing I really want to talk about this week is my approach for the Elder Scrolls Online, which is going to come out in about a month in April. So I will be purchasing the Imperial Edition, which is obviously the most expensive edition. I'm not sure whether or not I'm going to get the actual digital copy or the physical copy. The physical copy is like, uh, I think it's $20 more, it's $100, and it comes with like a Molog Ball statue and art book. I usually don't spring for collector's editions and stuff like that because they're just trying to upsell it and it's not really worth it to me. However, this game is going to be pretty big on my channel. I'm not sure if I should buy the physical copy or the digital copy. Regardless, I will be getting the Imperial Edition and pre-ordering so I can show you guys all the content that you can possibly get. I know a lot of people are disappointed with the game. I don't really understand it. I mean, it's it, if anything, it's just here to tide you over until the Elder Scrolls 6 or Fallout 4. I think Fallout 4 is going to come out before the Elder Scrolls 6. But it's just, it's, you know, it's another Elder Scrolls game to tide you over until those releases. So we only have less than a month to go, pretty much, until the Elder Scrolls Online. You're going to see a whole bunch of new content on my channel. And that's about it for this week's Sub Saturdays. So hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, I'll see you guys next week. Bye.